Hi James! We will read The Fun Guys. This book is titled The Rat Race. It was a yearly rat race. The fun guys were watching as the winner puffed his way past the winning post. King Rat presented a corn cup to the winner, but it was only Stump who saw a sad old rat huddled under the bush. What's the matter? asked Stump. They say I'm too old to join in the rat race, sobbed the rat as he wiped his eyes and sat down. Don't be upset, said Stump. Hang on a minute while I have a word with my friends. Stump came back with the rest of the fun guys. Come with us, Rat, he said. We're going to have our own sort of race and we needed you as a referee. At the start of the race, the fun guys had got into the backs of all the friends who had agreed to act as donkeys. Referee Hat raised his arm. Ready, steady, go! And the fun guys were off. But as the race wasn't going quite as they'd expected, and things got worse and worse. It seemed that no one knew where the finishing post was. The old rat fell to the ground, howling with laughter. I've never seen anything so funny in all my life. Ha 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 ha. The rat was making such a noise that other rats came to see what was going on. By this time, the referee had completely lost control of the race and the fun guys had lost control of their friends. With all of the fuss, no one noticed Toad creep away. Keep going, Snail, he whispered. We're going to fetch a little surprise for rat. Over the heads of the watching crowd, Rat's voice was heard. Stop! Stop! I declare you all winners! You've been around the winning post three times already! And it was then that Toad came back carrying his surprise. Here you are, Rat! This cup is for being the best referee ever, he said. The fun guy set up for a home and Inky turned and waved to a very happy old rat. He was still holding that cup, which would always remind him of the happiest day of his life.